This small German dog breed combines in its character the best qualities inherited from other larger German breeds. Fearlessness and courage, dedication and readiness to fight to the last drop of blood, devotion and insightful mind, all this is concentrated in a small but hot heart that beats in the York Terrier's chest. In this issue, you will learn a lot of interesting things about this breed. The York Terrier dog breed originated when, after World War I, a group of German breeders decided to create a breed exclusively for hunting. More precisely, not to create, but to recreate, since according to these same breeders, a similar dog existed and became extinct around the 18th century. The puppies of two black and two red terriers, which had the pedigree of pure fox terriers, were taken as a basis. To standardize the breed, crossings were carried out with the old English wire-haired terrier, as well as with the Welsh terrier. It took several years to create a dog with certain external characteristics and strong innate hunting instincts. Moreover, not an ordinary hunter, but a fox and badger hunter. Much attention was also paid to the character of these dogs, and the dog truly turned out to be unique. Not every dog, finding itself in a dark, cramped hole opposite a grinning and snorting badger, will decide to engage him in battle and pull him out of the hole, but the York Terrier knows how to do this and does it perfectly. The first German York Terrier Club was founded in 1926. Maximum functionality, this is how you can comprehensively characterize the appearance of the York Terrier. The breeders did not pursue external attractiveness, so all the characteristics of the dog are aimed at successful work. But despite the peculiar appearance of the dog, most breeders note the appearance of York Terriers as cute and funny. The Jag Terrier breed is compact in size, usually weighing no more than 10 kilograms, and has three main colors black, black brown and gray black. The length of the coat and its texture can vary from long and curly to short and smooth. The body is muscular and sinewy. There are two varieties smooth-haired and wire-haired York Terrier, but among hunters the most valued is the intermediate form the product of crossing both types. And if wire hairs have a pronounced beard and feathers on their paws, then hybrids, although less impressive in appearance, have exactly the length and structure of the coat that protects them as much as possible during the hunt, without creating interference. The Jag Terrier breed is a very active dog, with great potential for hunting a wide variety of game, and a huge amount of energy. If you are not into hunting, be prepared for the fact that you will be required to spend a lot of time outside, walking your pet and engaging in training and various games with it. If you thought that it would be difficult to find a dog more active than a Jack Russell, then the Jag Terrier is an excellent example of this, and will easily give even a Jack Russell a head start. It is difficult to imagine a more unpretentious dog than the York Terrier because ease of care was one of the key requirements when breeding the breed. These dogs are not afraid of either heat or cold they feel equally at home, both in a kennel on the street and in a comfortable city apartment. Their coat does not require trimming or frequent washing, just brushing it once a week is enough. If you are not a hunter, then be prepared to walk with your pet for several hours a day if he does not have the opportunity to spend his energy on something. This can result in aggression and, of course, destruction of the apartment. In the circle of their family, these are very kind and friendly dogs that are distinguished by great devotion to the owner and family members. This is an excellent companion for children's active games rest assured that children will be the first to get tired of throwing the ball rather than the York Terrier running after it. This breed requires proper training and socialization. It is best to introduce cats to cats at an early age, as this breed is genetically tuned to hunt small game and may view the cat as an object of pursuit. It is necessary to start socializing the puppy as early as possible, introduce him to other people, children and animals, let him understand that these are friends, and not a threat to the family and, of course, not game. If you don't do this, you may have problems in a crowded city. These dogs have great determination and stubbornness, the owner will have to work on these character traits in order to develop obedience, but not suppress natural instincts. It is determination and unbending will that allow the York Terrier to pursue or track prey for a long time, dig fox holes and be on his feet during the hunt for a huge amount of time. By the way, the desire to dig holes can become a problem for the owner of a private house who wants to have such a dog. The main qualification of the Yags is burrow hunting for fox, raccoon and badger, 
but with proper training the breed is capable of working with shot birds and even going after wild boar. The German Jag Terrier has a high pain threshold, so in fights the dog is not able to adequately assess the situation and continues to fight, even after receiving serious injuries. Because of their recklessness and passion, German Jag Terriers die while hunting more often than representatives of other breeds, so it is very important that the dog hears and obeys the owner's demands. It is important to understand that the German Jagd Terrier does not exist outside of hunting, so buying a dog for yourself on the sofa, or for children and expecting aristocratic manners from it is not the most logical thing to do. However, even a Jagd who regularly goes into the forest and works on animals is still obstinate. So say goodbye to the dream of making your pet an obedient delivery of slippers this breed loves to cooperate, but not to serve. It is believed that professional training and early education can dampen the aggression and stubbornness of German Jag Terriers, but there are also nuances here. Yes, a dog can be weaned from the habit of attacking strangers, but even an experienced dog handler will not be able to make him fall in love with a cat or other furry pet. Berries also attack small wild animals. For example, in rural areas, one of the main victims of the breed are hedgehogs. The black gladiators are not stopped by either needles or the injuries they cause reprisals against the prickly enemy are carried out immediately and to the bitter end. It's the same story with unfamiliar dogs. German Yacht Terriers have a strategic reserve of courage and the same amount of recklessness, therefore they are capable of provoking a conflict with their fellow tribesmen without any reason. The breed also has no time to understand the hierarchical system of the canine world, so even yagged puppies easily go to extremes, such as an attempt on someone else's bone or violent attacks on an adult wolfhound. Moreover, the larger the opponent, the more chances he has to infuriate the terrier, the impressive dimensions of the opponent cause even greater excitement in the yacht terrier. Yacht terriers are very smart and independent they are used to acting without a command, at their own discretion. Because in a hole left alone with a dangerous badger, you should not expect help and advice from the owner, you have to act according to the situation, so when training this breed, it is sometimes difficult to convey their will. These dogs are often distrustful of strangers, and consider all other animals as potential prey, and size does not matter at all, after all, even when hunting, they often come into battle with an animal much larger than themselves. Friends, thank you for watching to the end, write your comments, what you think about this breed, also write what breed you have and what breeds you want to see new releases about. Well, that's all for today, thank you all for watching, if it was interesting, support the video with likes, thank you for subscribing, and take a look at what else we have prepared for you.